Hey everybody and welcome back. Well, deciding what to make for dinner every night can be absolutely exhausting, especially for busy families. Yeah, that's right. But we're taking at least one decision off the menu with Chef Allie Hancock. You might recognize from local social media. She's here to help with some meal planning. Allie, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me. I'm super excited. Yes. We're very excited yes. to have you. And, and it already smells amazing. We everybody. got a little peek of what's inside the yeah. slow cooker and you are going to want to add this to the menu tonight. Yeah, so, absolutely. Um, first of all, talk to us a little bit about your path, your career. Why, did, why food? Why, why becoming a chef? I've always enjoyed food. It's been in our family, like holidays-wise, and that actually got me into gaining a lot of weight over the years of having like three kids, and I gained a lot of weight, and I needed to figure out how to get rid of that weight with still enjoying food. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I make lightened up meals. I share it on my social media. And I'm here to show you a lightened up version of something that could be super heavy in like restaurants or even if you make it at home. Mm -hmm. And it's really easy in the crock pot because you throw That's everything together. Such a lifesaver. And then walk out the door and then Dump it's and run. a simple right? thing when you get yep. home. And that's it. All right, so, awesome. So let's, how about we walk through it? Yeah, yeah, of course. So I have a crock pot and then I have an Instant Pot. This is a multi cooker that can turn into a crock pot. Excellent. In here I've got some raw chicken and all you're going to do is just season to your liking. So you got some salt, salt and pepper. pepper. Yeah. I Got think one some. of the best tips I've ever heard is if you season throughout, it tastes well seasoned, yes, but if absolutely. you salt at the end, it just tastes salty. That's absolutely. important to do every step. Right? Especially Look at the, you. Especially in the, in the Chef slow Marcy. cooker. Chef Food Network. Yeah. The slow cooker soaks up everything. That's why I love it so much. Right. What um, are those that you're putting in there, Italian Allie? seasoning and oregano, which a lot of people usually have on hand. Yeah, okay. very popular cabinet and staples, right? A really easy thing. Yes, we Minced are all about yeah. the pre-minced. Prepared, ready <laughs> to go. And then a jar of here. Ready to go, marinara. I love, love it. this one. So this, this one. is awesome because people don't have to spend time prepping this either. Not at all. And the chicken's frozen. Oh, so you, can you don't add have to fresh do, you don't have to buy frozen. it? No. That Amazing. will save many people from having fights. You forgot to take out the yeah, meat to yeah. defrost it? It's so like, you, honey, it's already in the crock pot. Hours. Okay. Set it for six hours. Set, set it, it. it. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye, walk out the door, get home. Kids are being crazy, you know, get the pasta on the stove. And you've got three yep. of your own, you know how I that goes. Three, yes. Yep. And then here's the finished product. You just put cheese on top of your liking. Looks I did some so um, fat-free mozzarella on here, just, you know, low calorie and the protein pasta, which is extra protein, keeps Amazing. you fuller longer. And then I'm just going to some fresh basil, right? Yes, fresh basil, of course. You know, I think a lot of people, Allie, right now are even paying a little bit more attention to what they're making at home, especially yes. coming out of, you know, the pandemic, a lot of people kind of made jokes about gaining a little weight during that because everybody was inside eating. Yeah. So, so you know, I was making oh my gosh, my look that. So that doesn't look like it's healthier, right? No, but it doesn't. I mean, it looks so good. the same as something that you would get at a gourmet restaurant. So you said this is basically a lightened up version of lightened chicken up ver version. Parm? Yeah, and if you want to get super fancy, you can, you know, saute some breadcrumbs and put that on top oh, um, if you really want to. Or you could do like a lightened up garlic bread. Right. Um, with low carb bread. Love it. Ooh, look at that with the fresh basil on and top. So pretty. Oh, and then you got You're some... holding out your bowl. I really yes. thought that you were doing an Oliver twist and asking for more already. But Mold you're trying to keep it fancy you're with a pretty bowl. I was just it's showing so it. It's so pretty, yeah. And you know what? The basil adds so much. Adding that color. It yes. smells. Absolutely. And it, then it adds that fresh Ooh. smell. Does it smell so good? I'm so excited. This okay, is great so for meal prep, too. I was going to say, because then you have, I mean, if you're feeding however many people in your family, you have meals for everybody. But then you yes. can freeze it. You can definitely freeze it. Um, my kids all approve from ages 3 to 11. Awesome. Husband approved. Nah, okay. Yeah. Two. That's <laughs> important. Like, yeah. That is important. Okay. Do you want I to already had mine, and it, I can say it's delicious. It heats up really well too afterwards, and for some reason, I think pasta heated up the next day is sometimes better. Yeah, I agree, I agree. with that because it has some time to soak That's it. So good. Now, oh, before flavors. we go, and people are probably getting get annoyed with me. Can we bring on mom and sister because <laughs> they're such a support system? Come on, get over your doorknob cake. Hey, come on, get in here. Your package too. And while yes. and while they're talking, this is your support system. Give and everybody, it takes a village, right? Give, give a lead to everybody. Hi. This is so fun. Hi, Hi Caitlin. So are you so proud of your sister? I'm great. How are you? I'm doing well. I know. Did you? Is this one of your favorites that Allie I makes? I love her recipes. I love it. I love her recipe. And she didn't even have to pay her to say it. She didn't. Yeah. Right. Give everybody your social media handles. Yes. Yeah. Chef Allie's Kitchen on Instagram. And I also have chefallieskitchen.com. You can find majority of my recipes there and it's tips and so tricks good. on my Instagram. 
sharing daily what I do and eat in a day Fantastic. every Wednesday. So. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks Allie. Allie. Thank you so much for coming. So much yes. We appreciate it. Ladies Thanks to the day. fam for coming. <laughs> Woohoo! All right.